Like a what? It creates a bunch of different vibes, all in all. In all. It's, hard. it's like it's hard for me to explain right now because I'm not like the right say it. This is just really random. This is like. Well, you know, in a sense, it's that's exactly what I mean. You've you've hit you've put your finger on it. It's random. Yeah. It's not. I mean, here I'm the artist talking, and nobody really wants to hear me talk. But the uh, or, uh, if this were in a gallery, and you walk through the door, and you knew something about it, you would be prepared when you walk through. You know, it wouldn't be random at all. You choose to go see it, choose to experience it. I think random's random's good, good, good. I mean, whether random's good or not, <laughs> I think that's a pretty good description. That's what I'm saying. I kind of feel like, for me personally, like, like it's entrapping, but at the same time, seeing like the whole thing right here, it's related with the seasons and all that. Like, there's some sort of, I guess, some sort of light because there's still like the events of life. Or, into it, you know, there's color, there's, and even though it's not a lot, it's like in this black box, so there's still something of grasp to grasp onto, even like, I don't know, that's, I don't know how to explain it better, but something like along those lines, that's, that's kind of what I felt. That, after I've done this for a while, you know, you do, you make this thing, and then you put it out here, and you have these paintings and stuff in it. And you get people's reactions. Uh, something I'd be interested in your reaction to this. I think it's. I think what I've done is like, and this you know may sound like BS, you know BS or something like that. But I think I. I think what it's about is like going to a place where you look at these little pictures, like you said, parts of life or something like it's that's very intentional and I think this is like literally you know here it is a place in and and it represents kind of the place you go yeah. you know internally what do you think about that you think that's BS or wait, wait it kind of represents where you go internally you know if you if you if if somebody says okay I'm going to show you great art or I'm going to you're going to go sit here a a nice piece of music or you hear a nice piece of music it takes you to a place or you look at a nice picture it takes you to a place right, right. this is to me personally I would say it, it kind of did like even I don't know I guess I guess it also has to do with the fact that it was two or three of us in there and there's different energy right but aside from that like that's kind of what I saw is there's light even in the darkest of places when you feel more entrapped and there's life there regardless and that's what it that's what it that's what kind of life it, that this piece of art and the feelings it gave to me thanks thank you you're welcome and this and the other young man here any thoughts other than it makes a good noise or maybe not a good noise <laughs> you responded to the idea of uh, Barbara or the name, at least when I said I thought it should have a name rather than just be a black box on the street. Well, it is just a black box on the street. It's an interesting black box on the street. Because so when you're in it, you don't really know what to think, judging off the photos. You've got fucking handcuffs, and then on the opposite side, you've got some of the roses. Weird. I do find it weird. Now sometimes when people say weird, that that's not very complimentary, and I and I I'm not saying it should be complimentary. Can you be any more specific though? More specific than weird? Like, like weird in a bad way? No, weird weird in a good way? Time. Just sitting in a black box, you have time. It's just there. It's weird. Is that about it?
about it. Thanks a lot, guys.